Hey friend, how would you like to automate all of your Facebook likes, comments, and shares in your social media marketing? Hmm, well maybe you've heard about Connect Automate and this new tool that's coming out that can help you do that with your Facebook posts. Hey, my name is Chris from ChrisandGia.com and in this exciting episode, we are going to do a Connect Automate review, all right? It's Wilco the Crag's new software tool that help you automate your Facebook posts. Can it actually help you make money? Can it actually help you give more time and, and leverage your social media and get more engagement? and shares and likes on autopilot? Let's find out. So hey, like I said, my name is Chris from ChrisandGia.com. The channel is all about empowering you, the home business entrepreneur, with the mindset and the online skill sets to get results, make money, and drive breakthroughs, all right? So if you like content like that, reviews like this, then hey, definitely give the video a like, consider subscribing to the channel, and smash that bell. That's right, smash that bell right now. So you, because you'll be notified whenever I drop new videos, which is pretty much almost daily right now. All right, so let's get into this thing. This is the Connect automate review. It's an internet new marketing product tool, software tool, we'll go to Christ got coming out. So let's see what it can do. It can actually help you make more money and leverage your time. All right. So the creator, like I mentioned, is a gentleman by the name of Wilco the Cry. So he is a multiple, he's behind the, the creative genius behind multiple seven figure platforms like UpViral, Connect Leads, Connect Explore, Connect Retarget. He's been an internet marketer for many, many years now. Very successful. In fact, I used his UpViral tool, which was a tool that allowed you to create contests and it's actually quite good pretty good so he's very he knows exactly what he's doing and um, yeah so who, who is connect automate for well I tell you what it's pretty much anyone who wants to make money online if you're an affiliate marketer internet marketer social media marketer blogger, YouTuber, freelancer, you're in e-commerce. If you're a consulting or coach or network marketer, this is probably for you because hey, you're most likely using social media marketing in your business and most likely you could use a tool that can automate that for you and help you get the, the most out of your ads. Which brings us to what exactly is Connect Automate? Well, essentially what it is is a software tool, right? That is rule-based. In other words, you create rules so that it will go ahead and automatically identify Facebook posts that you post on your page that have the most engagement from your audience and then creates ads from those and then targets the best audience for you. Yeah, it's pretty awesome. And then from there, it'll find the winning ads that are actually working and then knock off all the ones that don't work and then only keep up the ones that are working and winning for you. In other words, getting the, the whatever it is that you're trying to get your ad to do, whether it's to get sleeves or get conversions and sales. So it ends up putting the right ad in front of the right people at the right time automatically. So yo, that's pretty cool, right? All right. So what's the pricing on this thing? It starts off about 47 bucks per month. All right. So let's take a quick look at exactly what's going on with Wilco the Cry's tool here. So this is the gentleman himself right here, right? And like I said, Connect Automate is basically helps you identify your winning ads and will eliminate all your losers so, you, so that you're only putting money behind your likely winners. So essentially, if you're putting creating Facebook ads, right, the biggest challenge is trying to figure out, well, which ones are working, you know, which ones is actually giving me the best return on my investment, right? Because you don't want to be spending money on ads that are not targeted to your right customer, that's not speaking the right message, therefore not giving you the most clicks, the most leads, and the most sales that you could be getting. And this tool helps you to weed through that, through those struggles that is Facebook marketing, all right? And so it turns your best performing posts into ads for you, which is awesome, right? If you're already getting a lot of engagement on your posts and love tons of likes and shares, why not turn that into an ad? This will do that for you on autopilot. And then of course, it automates the entire process from identifying those high engagement ads all the way to creating the ad for you, submitting the ad for you, and monitoring the performance. Yeah, then we'll go to cry. His tools are always on point. And Connect Automate doesn't seem to be any different, right? And so Beauty Buddy, like we said, is that you're targeting the your buyer at the right time, the right time for them, right? If it's not the best time for them, then they're most likely not going to engage in your post. Therefore, showing that post in front of them doesn't make sense, right? But if someone is clicking, yay, I like your video, commenting on it, hey, that person is engaged. That person is the most likely a person that you want to show that that post to again and again until you get them to the point where they become a customer. And that's basically what the tool is doing, right? Showing your, your your post to the right people at the right time. So let's take a quick look at a quick demo here. 
that I think will be helpful, right? So essentially here is what the tool looks like in, in, in you know, once you're in the back office. And it's pretty simple, right? You're basically going, once you get in, you're just going to create conditions, create rules so that the system will automatically know what to do when it sees a post that fits the criteria that you set. So literally you can create, you know, pick your, uh, your Facebook page here, and then you can pick the type that you want, right? So let's say you're wanting a status or photos or video po posts. Now you can put all of those in there so that the tool knows, okay, that's what, that's what we're going to be looking for, right? That's what we want. And then you can tell it how many number of posts you want it to promote at any one time, right? So that's pretty cool. So maybe you don't want to do too many at a time so that you can test which one's working, but you always want to have at least two so that you can compare. You have a control and then you have a, then you have an experiment, a variable so that you can see which one's working best for you, right? And then here's where you you can create the different conditions, right? So for example, maybe you just want to see you know, you want it to like only pick up, let's say, post or picture post that you put in that have a certain number of likes in it. So if you get a certain number of likes, then that, hey, that's how you know that's a, that's something that you want the tool to pick up because, hey, maybe that's getting a lot of engagement, right? So you can you can set it for 50 likes, maybe 20 likes, 100 likes, depending on the type of engagement you normally get. You know your, your, your best type of audience. So Apple, get out the way. <laughs> All right. And so you can set that up and then you can you, you can set it up so that it looks for posts from the last 30 days, from the last year, for however long you want. Right. And so that's what's pretty cool about it. Then the next step is once it does that and it matches it, it's going to, you know, you, of course, like I said, you can change it too. Instead, instead of just post likes, maybe you want it for a certain number of post reactions or a certain number of share rate, number of people sharing it, or a number, a certain number of comments, right? Any one of these things you can kind of use to create the type of rules you want so that it's only promoting the type of post that you want. And then the next stage is campaign settings, right? So you have to set up your ads account. So if you don't have a Facebook ads account, obviously this is not going to work so well for you, right? So you would pick your Facebook ads account and then you can create a campaign name, type in whatever it is that you want, right? You can uh, optimize it for whatever objective that you want. So you want conversions, do you want page likes, do you want post engagement, do you want video views, right? So I mean these are the, the specific objectives that are usually what you will pick when you create a Facebook ad Facebook ad in the first place. So you can you have control of all of that. You can even you know set up a pixel there as well. And then then you go into the ad set settings, right? So ad set is usually the one that that's the setup. So you have the campaign, then you have the ad set and then you have the ad, right? So the ad set is usually for where you're picking your audience and you're setting your budget and things like that. So you can see here, hey, run the ad for a certain number of days. You can create a new ad set. You can have a budget set up. You can have an audience, a targeted audience. You can have a goal that you're looking for specifically, all these different things. And um, it just kind of gives you a lot of flexibility and picking what it is that you best want for your particular ad. So of course, you can optimize it for impact pressures, post engagement, reach, landing page views. So it's pretty comprehensive, but all at the same time, pretty simple, right? I mean, it's kind of simple, very easy to kind of go through. You can set up your rule name, the name of your rule, and then turn it on so that you get email alerts whenever it gets activated. So you set up your email. And then once you do that, literally you just click submit and you are good to go. I mean, so I think that's pretty cool, right? I think that's something that's pretty cool that uh, that you can use if you're a Facebook marketer. So let's take a look. So in terms of some of the things that I like, Hey, like I said, it's an automated tool to help you with your Facebook advertising, which really it's a must for social media marketing, right? I don't know if you've noticed, but you can't really just rely on the organic reach on t platforms anymore, especially Facebook, right? And they're not doing it. They're not, Zuckerberg already has kind of said it, but not really said it, that they're limiting organic reach. You can't really build a huge audience just by posting organically. You're going to have to run ads. I promise you that was the trick that I eventually learned that I was posting all these things on Facebook and wasn't getting the engagement because Facebook is limiting how many people see my stuff anyway, right? So you really have to start to run ads. If you're going to use Facebook, I really feel like advertising Facebook ads is the only way to use it. 
right? And so if you're gonna use Facebook ads, and this is a great tool to kind of help you along the way, and that's automated in terms of helping you process those posts that seem to get the most engagement. Of course, then it saves you time, helps you create leverage, so you don't have to focus on creating these ads each time. It's automatically doing it for you, and you can just throw in a couple of dollars. Five dollars a day can really give you be pretty impressive in terms of helping you build that audience, build those people that start to know you, like you, and trust you. And of course, you're automatically leveraging your best performing post, which I love. It's almost like curating your own content. You definitely want to take advantage of content that you're already using that seems to be the best type of stuff, right? So, and then on top of it, the platform seems pretty simple to use. It's very not very techy, right? So I thought it was pretty simple. Now, in terms of some of the things I don't like is that, well, hey, not that I don't like, but these are kind of cons to the whole thing is that number one, you got to learn how to run Facebook ads, right? <laughs> and if you don't know how to do that, you may struggle with using this tool or as a matter of fact, you may not even be able to use this tool. So that's something to consider. Although I think we'll go to cry has something in it up his sleeves to help you with that. So that's something to consider. And number two, you will need a budget. So if you don't have a marketing budget that you're putting aside for strictly building your audience and building your brand, that's something you're going to have to think about doing. Can you afford $5? a day some people might say that some people can that's just about the price that we pay for drinking starbucks every day right and then ultimately my biggest thing that you always have to remember is that this is a tool it is simply a tool for your business and not your business okay so you need to understand what your main business is what it is you do what value you bring to the marketplace and that is the thing that you have to focus on this tool is only supposed to help you as a conjugate you know as a helper as an a, an assistant to your main goal, right? Of providing that specific value. However way you do that, whether it's coaching, consulting, affiliate marketing, e-commerce, this is a tool to help you do that and it's not your business. So don't rely on this tool and don't get sucked into the shiny object tool thing. But if you already have a business and you use Facebook ads and you do those type of things, you run ads, then this may be a very good tool to help you along with that, all right? So if you ask me my overall impression, you know what? I give this thing four stars. You know, it's a pretty cool software tool that automatically leverages your best performing social media posts for more engagement. All right, it gives you leverage, and it's created by a guy that's been in the game. Very solid tool. When I had, when I used UpViral, customer service was always on point, really good. So hey, you can only go right with this thing. All right, so hopefully that's helpful for you. Hopefully it help, helps you decide whether or not you want to check out the tool. The link is in the description below right now. If you want to check it out. All right, hopefully it was helpful. All right, and if you did, hey, definitely give the video a like. Consider subscribing to the channel up here. And like I said, if you want to check out by my boy Look of the Cry, check out the link in the description below. All right. And so until the next exciting episode, be blessed, stay hungry. I'll see you on the next one. Peace.